with a first alert weather day tomorrow. Tomorrow, yes, this rain is much needed. It has been incredibly dry through the month of June. So the fact that we finally have some scattered rain and storms in the forecast, this is definitely a blessing. It is a low impact event. Not everyone, unfortunately, going to see the rain, but the chances are fairly good. About a 50% chance of much needed rain tomorrow. Looks like we'll see a wave in the morning with some scattered AM showers in the mid to late morning, and then we will see some pop up afternoon storms storms as well. Until that system gets here, it will be sunny and hot today, but this evening you'll notice increasing clouds and after sunset that chance of rain returns from the west. A few showers overnight. There's that first wave of rain tomorrow morning, so a first alert weather day at 10 a.m. Again, not everyone getting it, but we will see some scattered rain around 9, 10, 11 a.m. And then as we head into the afternoon, some additional pop up showers and storms after about 3 p.m. that will continue continue in the afternoon and into the evening, and this is going to set off a pattern change, a very summer like pattern. This is what we typically see this time of year where we have at least a chance of rain in the forecast, a low chance Friday, but then Saturday into Sunday, another wave of rain and storms possible in the forecast. With that chance of rain, we're also going to see high heat and humidity, and today that heat's certainly holding over North Georgia, already 94 in Atlanta, 98 in Eatonton. It's 95 in Athens compared to this time yesterday. Already five, six, seven degrees warmer even than yesterday. And yesterday we reached the upper 90s and those temperatures will continue to climb by about five or six o'clock. I am expecting the temperatures to be around 100 degrees in Atlanta. So drink lots of water, find the shade, take frequent breaks, and please be careful. Very hot across the entire state. 99 in Rome, 98 in Carrollton today, 100 in Covington, up to 102 in Eatonton. Air quality an issue again today. Again, with that heat, it makes the air quality poor for sensitive groups. So those with asthma need to limit their time outdoors in the late afternoon and early evening. The heat doesn't go anywhere. In fact, it sticks around behind the system. Slightly lower temperatures Thursday, Friday, Saturday with those rain chances, but it does stay pretty hot through the weekend. On Saturday, the rain chance is not as high, but about a 30% chance of afternoon pop-ups. Slightly higher on Sunday with a 40% chance. If those rain chances trend up, we may need a first alert weather day for Sunday. So certainly something the entire first alert weather team is watching. Good idea to download the first alert weather app. You can see the radar. It will alert you tomorrow if rain and storms are approaching your area.